This is the new Techno Spark 30C and is the new addition to their latest Spark series. And with the price of about $90, it is obvious that this is an entry level device. But nevertheless, does this smartphone worth that price? Let's talk about it. The unboxing experience is similar to every entry level techno device out there. Opening the box, you see the smartphone. MTN voucher, 18 watt charger, a warranty card, plastic silicon case, a pair of earphones, a USB cable, and a SIM ejector pin. In a world that smartphones are not coming with chargers, I'm still very happy that Techno is in the business of providing everything in the box. Now for the design and the build quality. The design of the Techno Spark 30C is very clean and slim. I really, really, really like it especially in this colorway. I like the camera placement and I think this is the first time I'll be seeing this kind of camera design in a Techno device, especially in this budget category. And to be honest, looking at it doesn't look like a cheap device at all. On the left side, we have the power button that also double as a fingerprint scanner. It's not the fastest thing in the world, but it works. And we also have the volume up and the volume down buttons which is the standard. On the left side, we have the SIM card tray that can take two SIM cards and an SD card option if you need it. At the bottom, we have the headphone jack, a USB Type-C port, a microphone, a stereo speaker setup, one at the bottom and one at the top. And to my surprise, they sound good for that price. Still on the build, at the back, we have this nice circular camera bump I think it is the same camera bump on the Camon 30 Pro 5G, a more expensive device. And seeing that here is actually nice. We talk more on the camera later. The build quality actually exceeded my expectation. For a $90 smartphone, that is actually impressive. Let's talk about the display. Techno actually stepped up in this display department, but it won't blow your mind. Let me explain. First of all, this device is a 6.6 .6 inches 720p LCD display, which is the standard for an entry level device at this price point. That is not new. But what is new is that this $90 smartphone has 120Hz refresh rate. Not only that, Techno also gave us the option to switch between 60 and 120Hz which is actually a big deal because this feature is only available on high-end flagship devices. Yeah, even though this display won't blow your mind or make you shout wow, it still works and content consumption on this display will work just fine, just like the ITEL A50 and the Samsung Galaxy A05. Again, considering this price point, this is actually an okay display for an average user that just wants something that works, it is fine. It is not too flashy, colors are accurate and most importantly, it gets the job done and brightness is also okay. You won't have problem using it outdoors as it gets bright enough thanks to the 500 nits peak of brightness which is actually a big deal again at this price point. Let's talk performance. Again, this is a $90 smartphone so you should not expect world class performance or flagship performance. It is equipped with a MediaTek Helio G81 chipset and as you might have guessed, this is not a gaming chipset. So if you are getting this to game, I would advise you skip this one. Performance is okay, it won't blow your mind, but it is very okay for day-to-day -day tasks like browsing the web, playing light games like Candy Crush and Subway Surfers, but bear in mind that this again is not a gaming phone, even though it should run COD or PUBG but I would advise you not to do that because you won't even enjoy the game. We have the 4 gigs of RAM variant and the 6 gigs of RAM variant but I would advise you go for the 6 gigs of RAM variant considering that you are only willing to spend the extra cash. Overall, the kind of performance that this device offers is very acceptable for that price. For software, the Techno Spark 30C comes with Android 14 out of the box and is not different from the standard Techno skin you have seen before. We have the dynamic port that shows your battery level. We have Ella, the voice assistant. We have memory fusion thanks to Android 14. We also have minimal Bluetooth and unwanted apps 
but you can always uninstall them right to give your device this clean look you're looking for let's talk about the cameras again it won't blow your mind but i think for that price it can pass the techno spark 30c have a 50 megapixel main camera and the flashlight at the back don't be deceived and a 5 megapixel selfie camera the camera quality won't blow your mind it will only take okay pictures under good lighting condition but under low light it struggles significantly and the results are not even usable again at this price range this is definitely not bad at all and if pictures and videos are your priority this is definitely not the phone to get but if you're an average user and you just want something that is usable definitely and for videos it shoots at 2k 30 frames per second max for battery life the spark 30c comes with 5000 mAh battery and this is the standard in 2024 and this will definitely last you the entire day with a single charge even two days if you are a light user so battery is pretty solid and for charging it comes with an 18 watt fast charger out of the box and it take about two hours to charge your phone from zero to 100 which is decent again at this price range uh i would say the spark 30c is actually a good competition to the itel a50 and the samsung galaxy a05 and it even offers more in some departments compared to these other devices and i would say it is a fantastic cheap smartphone that gives value for your money it has nice build quality decent performance for the price software is clean beyond my expectations and a good battery life and if you are in the market for a device that checks all the boxes without breaking the bank i think the techno spark 30c might just be the one that is my review on the techno spark 30c thank you so much for watching as always and let me know your opinion about the techno spark 30c in the comment section below and if you are using this device let us know your experience in the comment section below don't forget to hit the like button subscribe to the channel if you're new we are close to 1000 subscribers and as always love peace and tweaks signing out